Hi everyone, welcome back to the second video of uh, login and registration with the user token. In last video, we will uh, learn how we can uh, register the uh, new user with the token and we will get the token back also when we use the Laravel passport package. Uh, so now we are continuing this video and here we will learn how we can login this and after the login how we can get the data from the token only. So now let's get started. So if you don't watch your previous video then you should have to watch this because with that you have to learn how the things are implemented here. Okay. So as you can see in the api.php uh, the router is already created in the last video which is the user control at the login. So I'm just going to make a function here. So just make a function at the public accessor with the name of login and here I'm just going to use the my user model and first of all I will just use the a hard code value and after that I will implement it with the uh, requested value also so just check it here so I can just simply use the select star We have to wait condition and in the where I'm just giving them my email ID, which is uh, belong to here, and it can be anil at the rate test.com. And we have to get the first value. So be careful, we don't need have you don't need to put here uh, get, you have to just use the first method here, okay. And after that, you can just copy the same code to save the time. And now let's try. So just I'm going to try with that. Let's try. Okay, so so don't confuse with that values because they are not just going to work here because a hardware value is just working here. Okay. So you can see that we got the token and this token is working with the every, everything. So if I just misspell it and it will give me the error. This is for the confirmation. So now you can see that we got the token is not fine. All right. So you can put the uh, a try and catch block also fine. So now how we can do it with the, um, the requested value also. So for that just uh, see the time you can uh, catch this link which is given on the GitHub repository so you can for, uh, get this code from here so I'm just uh, getting up my login code from here so just copy from here this code simply and it's sim pretty much similar just it will check the uh, login and username with the auth from here all right so now let's try once again so first of all let's try it okay so it will telling that uh, the value is not fine because we did not pass the value yet when i just pass the value from here then uh, there is some issue uh, bug due to the because auth control is not found so that's my bad we have to add the auth controller here also so, so you can put put here and i think everything is completed now so now let's see now you can get the value from this token also all right so if you put something wrong here then it will warn you this is this is the undefined all right so now uh, this is also done so now how we can fetch this value and use this token with the, the next api for that what i'm going to do i'm going to define one more uh, uh, function with the name of detail so uh, as you can see that in the last video we see that we have to define the detail router inside the uh, middleware something like this okay so just you can copy the code from here also fine so just now I'm going to copy this token from here this one just paste here simply 
and you have to use the bearer and it should be in the header not in the body be careful and the authentication name is the header here so let's use the bearer so sometimes we just misspell this so be careful this also with the spelling okay so now you can see that we got the data here all right so everything data is coming here we uh, log in with the proofs so just i'm logging with the some other name so just log in with the anil.test password is same for everyone this is the xyz okay so okay so sorry this i just try to enter the new values here okay so we got the token and just copy this one and now you will see that we got the information about the someone other that is we login which is the anil so now you can see that we got the data for the anil here with the help of this function so this is about the how we can log in and how we can uh, get the details from the token and how we can use the token so if you have still any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box and that uh, you can follow me uh, on the given things uh, like the facebook and instagram are uh, they are also mentioned in the description box you can find this code on the my uh, git repository don't forget to subscribe our channel like this video thanks guys thanks for watching this video